Hello and welcome to another episode of Lemur's Corner. I am Lemur and today we are going to be playing Art Catching a Mosasaurus. So what I'm doing here is I am actually making a Mosasaurus trap. Um, this is kind of one of the easiest ways to uh, get this done. We're going to do this almost the exact same method as we would do a Quetzal trap. So this is going to be what's called a Mosasaurus trap. And what I'm going to do here is I'm going to uh, use this trap to capture the Mosasaurus, uh, hopefully locking it in from killing my um, Plessy. Uh, if not, my Plessy has a good amount of health and it should be able to survive long enough for it to work perfectly. Uh, so the goal here is to create a large structure that is large enough to fit the Mosasaurus in, uh, but also uh, make it so it can't leave it also. Uh, so. Uh, we got the last pieces in there, and now we're going to place our ceilings in here. Uh, basically, if you guys want to see, I have my foundations and my ceilings and my walls, uh, and that should allow me to get to uh, the place I need to be with uh, this. So technically, you do not have to go all the way through everything. Um, I could technically just kind of finagle it in here, but the whole point is, is to get a nice seal uh, on this. Uh, I am building this underground. I have already cleared out a lot of the dinosaurs. Uh, so the goal here is to make it to where uh, I don't have to worry about too much. Uh, one of the biggest things you have to make sure you do is put it on passive. Uh, so I am going to have to put two dinos on passive specifically for this. Um, and I'm going to get those set up really quick right now. Uh, one is going to be this Megalodon in case I need it to attack stuff. Uh, the second one is going to be uh, the Plezzy. So I'm putting on passive. It's on passive. We're in a good spot. And the Plezzy needs to be put on passive also. Uh, especially the Plezzy because it's going to be extremely important. Now, what you could do is have the Megalodon following. I have the ability to do Pokeballs, um, so I'm going to use those. Ooh, we get hit by something. And we got that shark killing us, so we're going to kill that shark really quick. It shouldn't be too hard. So he's going to get some food. Now we have to go find... There it is. You can see the Mosasaurus. We'll go ahead and jump out so you guys can see what we're going after. It's going to be this Mosasaurus right here. We're going to trap it. It's got 28 K support. It's going to take a little bit, but uh, the key is, is all we have to do is jump in, trap it, and then jump out uh, is the overall goal here. So what we're going to do is get in here, hopefully. Trap this thing without getting too much caught up in it. Of course, we're going to get a Plezzy coming in now. So we are going to have to kill these Plezzies. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to run up. Uh, get the Megalodon or the Mosasaurus to stop attacking me and then we will kill those really quick. So what we are going to do here is try to get um, slide the Mosasaurus in and then jump off uh, and capture it. I did not get it here so I'm going to try one more time. So what we're trying to do is it's you're trying to create a so when you're moving it's not considered a solid object and then when you stop moving is when it is a solid object so as I said the goal here is to continually try to get this to snake in on this guy so we can get him tamed that's the goal uh, he's not getting off the ground which sucks but that's why we run into a little bit of an issue So we're just going to go ahead and start taming this guy. He's pretty well trapped. See, most, he's not getting hit now because we've got that trap in nicely. I can even shoot him through the thing if I wanted to, but I'm going to go around. And just keep drilling this guy until he goes down. We can just shoot him right in the tail. I'm loading all of our arrows. I could be counting these out for maximum effort, um, but we should need to. Four, five. Well, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand. Five, one thousand. Well, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, four, one thousand. Two, one thousand, three, one thousand, four, one thousand, five, one thousand. 
So what we're going to do is we're going to speed up the video here for you guys uh, as I continue to tame this thing. It's going to take a little bit of time, as you know. Uh, we'll see you back here in a little bit once we've got this thing nice and tame. But this is really all we're doing. We're pinning it against the wall. We're using our giant structure to capture it. It doesn't hurt my plezzy. Uh, and it's just going to sit there and get waxed. Uh, so we'll see you guys back here in a minute once we've got this thing all nice and knocked out and ready to go. And there we have it. So we have a Mosasaurus now. Uh, as I said, that was a level uh, 130, that 40 that we just tamed like that. Uh, it's got really good stamina, 46 stamina points, uh, which is fantastic, actually. Uh, it's got 33 health and only 18 melee, so it sucks, but it's good health. Mosasaurus, so we'll put a lot of points into its health, maybe some damage in there because it's going to suck. Um, but maybe we can get a second one, get a female, uh, breed in some damage to it. But there we go. We have a Mosasaurus. Easy peasy. Uh, no major issues there. And that's going to be it for this episode. So I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you liked the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Uh, if you are new to the channel, make sure you guys subscribe. Hit that bell for notifications. If you have anything to add, a better way to do this, go ahead and leave a comment down below. But always, um, we are always open to that. But as always, make sure you have a fantastic day. And we see you on the next episode of Lemur's Corner. <laughs>